If you want to test a connection between two computers or two servers, whether it may be on a local network or on the internet, Netcat is a perfect tool to do that as it allows both to listen on a port and also connect to it. So in this example, I'm going to show you how to open a TCP port connection as well as a UDP connection and then also to connect to, to that. So in the first example, I will now open with Netcat on port one to three. So basically NC is for the network con uh, Netcat command, dash L stands for listen, and one to three is the port that we're going to open in the first shell. And let's assume the second one is a other computer over the internet. Obviously these machines need to be technically able to do that. So they must be on the same network. So you cannot connect uh, from the internet to a machine that is in a private network. And using nc-vz localhost in that case, because I would just do it locally on my machine. You could also replace that of course with an IP address. And that port we just opened here in the listen command. Uh, with that, we can connect to that. So NC is again for netcat, dash VZ means like um, V stands for, uh, for a more verbose output. And basically uh, Z is just for single connection to a daemon to just check if it's up. And of course the host name and the port. So here you can see the connection was successfully established and the server also just stopped already. So now we can do the same with UDP. Uh, that works basically the same way. You just add a U to listen to UDP and you can see the port here is open and we could then do the same thing with VZ and U. And once trying to connect to that, you can see something is happening here and we succeeded connecting.